pictures on them and they, they're all alive. They have both the top shells um, attached to them. We want to make sure that they are alive. And so if, the, if you can see if the top shell has come off, then we don't want to collect those. But this is a good example of what we're looking to keep. Audubon has been working on a Rambrew Island, this 19-acre this island in Richardson Bay, for about 18 months. We've been writing permits, we've been planning and working with partners, we've been doing research. We've been working hours and hours and hours on this project for the last 18 months. Today, as we undertake this current piece of work, with construction starting in 19 days, today feels like the day that this project is really starting for me. Um, today we are taking oysters, native oysters that live on this beach, are being removed from this beach because in 19 days, big machinery is gonna come in here to do the construction we need to make this more healthy habitat and a more stable island that's ready for climate change. So today we have to get these native oysters off this beach and out of the way of the big equipment. We'll take the native oysters that are living on these rocks over to the sanctuary beach over at, at Richardson Bay Audubon Center. We'll put them on the beach there at the same tide level. They'll live happily over there for a year and hopefully reproduce more baby oysters. And then when construction is over, we will bring these rocks back over here. We'll put them back in, in a way such that they act as erosion control. We'll make little um, berms and groins out here with the oysters and in, in mimicking nature to, keep, to help with the erosion protection for this beach. So today this project is starting for me and we are really excited to have four Audubon staff and six volunteers helping us move these oysters.